It is opening night. A huge night for both sets of fans. Match day one in the UEFA Champions League. Who will get off to a flying start? Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello and welcome. Not just the pressure of the occasion, but also the elements for the players to deal with tonight. A rainy evening at the San Siro. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by Lee Dixon, and we're up against Monaco. Yeah, the long road to the final starts here in Game 1. Oh, Patrick Cutrone! Well, not really a shooting moment he's going to be especially proud of, Lee. Well, he did have other options, but he thought, you know what, I'm just going to have a go. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Well, clattered away. Match day one in the Champions League, always exciting. And as soon as the teams were drawn into this particular group, we all thought, my goodness, that's a hard one to predict the outcome of. Oh, wow, well, the so-called group of death, it really is a competitive one, this one. Imperative, you get off to a good start. You don't want to be playing catch-up when there's two teams like that ahead of you. Well, he has to be regarded always as a dangerous opponent. But what should we expect to see from him in this game, Lee? He's on the ball all the time. His ability on the ball is absolutely phenomenal. He doesn't pass the ball away. He lends it to his teammates because he wants it back. Very difficult to get the ball off him. Now, Ronnie Lopez. And dribbling with it, but out of play. Ronnie Lopez. Now, what can he do here? And whipped into the box. And on the volley, that's not exactly how he intended to catch it. Well, it's worth a chance. One in ten, it goes in the top corner. Nine out of ten, goes where it did do. Ndidi. Tielemans. Chalanoru. And now, Müller. That move looked as though it had genuine potential, but it's broken down. There's no doubt about it, the UEFA Champions League has come a long way since it came into existence back in 1992-93. And there are many, Lee, who say it's the highest standard of football you'll see anywhere. Well, I think it is the best club competition uh, in the world. I think the competition at the top, at the end, near the final, etc., is what it is. But the tournament is strong throughout the group stages and then the knockout stages. It's the perfect format for me. Thomas Müller in control of the situation. Tielemans, effective challenge. Ronnie Lopez. It's with Cutrone. An utterly disappointing cross. Goal kick. Matip now. This is Müller. Threaded through by Müller. Sousa with it. Teammate in support. Might be a chance here. And there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. Ndidi. Given away by Milan. He had the sixth sense to know what to do and win it back. Benjamin Henrichs. Now can he make this move count? He's going forward well here. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Beautifully timed. Forced into the penalty area. Not all that convincing defensively. The goalkeeper relatively untroubled. Yeah. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here.
into the second half then and these two sides are locked together just can't really choose between them at the moment he might be able to profit from the wide position it's been whipped towards the near post a corner will ensue Now the delivery. And a deep ball in. And he's clear as lines. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Now the execution of the corner. Well, a sloppy clearance. What can the opposition do with this? Vallejo. Here's Tielemans. Thomas Muda. Let's see what he has in store for them. And a goal it is! The opener in this game. Well, keep it tight. That's what both managers would have been insane. But now the opening goal's gone in. Tactics have got to change. Well, let's see that one again. It's all about the contact. Does everything right. He's not bothered where the goal is. He knows where it is. He gets a beautiful strike on it. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. It's a privilege to be here today for this very special fixture. The interest has been enormous. Every time they meet each other, these two teams, it is a very special day.
Hi there, I'm Martin Tyler, and this is the San Siro. The sign we're looking at for goals, I think, in this one is Milan. They, uh, to use that old commentator's cliche, can't stop scoring. Well, we should expect goals because this team has got some really good strikers who are banging form. This is the Milan lineup. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the goalkeeper. Vallejo starts with Joel Matip as the centre backs. Suso plays with Hakan Chalhanoglu out wide. And here is just the one main attacker in this lineup. Saw the goal and went for it. And he's caught that right, but just off target. Wow, not too much wrong with the technique there. Conte. Well, two teams that have started well this season, Martin. Both steered through. Suso. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Strong challenge. And Didi. And it's going to be his throw here. Linetti. Correa. Here's a chance to go down the outside of the opposition. Read that well with the interception. Got past his marker. Then in the shot, go! Tried to keep it down, but couldn't. If he had of, I think the keeper might have been struggling there. Now, Vallejo. Read the play well to intercept. It's given away. Tielemans. Muller. Thielen crafting the through pass. Oh, it's a great goal! Well, he got to the position of maximum opportunity. It was an impossible opportunity to squander. Yeah, you often say it was an easy chance, but you have got to be there. This lad has got the knack of doing that. Muller. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. Suso. Telemans. The offside flag went up. Linetti. Here's Depay. Saw the pass coming and got there first. Mendy. Tielemans. Taking on the defenders. That is a dangerous move, sliding in with the ball in the box like that. Being closed down here. And he's got the ball away from him with the tackle. That's a good spot by the defender. Sometimes, uh, certainly in uh, days gone by, and a way draw was seen as a, a good result. I think most teams go to try and win the matches. They've drawn their last three, the visiting team today. Yeah, they have. I mean, they've been solid defensively. They're quite an organised side, which will... Threads it through. Had to be brave coming out there, the goalkeeper. Lovren. Linetti. It's a good place to win the ball here. Clever ball. And he scored! Well, the keeper really couldn't get anywhere near. First time hit with real velocity. Just widen the margin here to 2-0. Lovren. Kevin Campbell. Luis Alberto. That's a great interception. Linetti. The pie. Now, can he take them on? Put into the middle. Not very easy for the goalkeeper there. Excellent interception. He's got his shot off now. 
saw the goal and went for it. Well, in these circumstances, he's going to take that chance. Well, he certainly has. That's going to lift the team that's already ahead, and I think they're going to go on and win this now. Quick-witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. Kevin Campbell. Played in the clear. Here's the chance. That's what... Half-time now, and 2-0 is the score at the break. Well, everyone... Here we go for the second half. Well, what a special game we have for you tonight in the group stage. Both teams with real ambitions to go far in this competition. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Anfield, one of the most storied venues anywhere in the football world. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me here on the commentary box for complete coverage is Lee Dixon. And we've got UEFA Champions League group stage action to bring you tonight. It is Liverpool facing Milan. Well, Derek, both teams got off to a flying start in their opening group match, didn't they? But something has to give tonight. Looking forward to this one. And the short option preferred. This move counts. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Virgil van Dijk plays with Daniele Rugani in central defence. Sadio Mane starts with Mohamed Salah out wide. And leading the attack today is the ultimate pressing machine, Roberto Firmino. Here's the Milan team. Joel Matti plays alongside Vallejo in central defence. And the main striker today is Thomas Müller. Matip now. It's with Mendy. Here's Tielemans. Thomas Muda. Given away by the Rossoneri. So, glancing at the table, and I must say, when the teams came out of the various pots for the Champions League draw, a really sumptuous ball. Fed over towards the back post. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. It's with Mendy. And 
Mohamed Salah now. And here is Oxlade Chamberlain. A case of foiling the opposition by whatever means. Corner awarded to Liverpool. They've taken this corner short. Well, the clearance half hearted. High echelon goalkeeping there. Keen to take it short here. And he's pulled it back here. Fine reaction save from the goalkeeper. Goalkeeping at its best. Really, really top draw. He's driven in the corner. Now, what can he do here? Fabinho. Well, let's see what he has in store for them. Nuda distributing magnificently. Well, now in a dangerous position. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. And what a magical save it was! Corner awarded. Soso's delivery. Well, lacking in direction with that header. He was under duress. Yeah, the defender just put him off a little bit, but it's worth an effort. If it goes in, he's a hero. Given away by Milan. It's with Fabinho. Mane. It's with Roberto Firmino. And Firmino. It might be the moment to get them ahead. Powerful enough, but not precise enough. No, not accurate enough at all. He had other options on as well. It's with Mendy. Here's Tielemans. This is Müller. And they are on the move again. Chalanolu! Will there be a tangible end product? Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. Tielemans. Is he going to punish them here? Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Vallejo. It's with Chalanolu. And here's Ndidi. Oxlade Chamberlain. They don't normally need a second invitation to give it a go on the counter. This is Salah. Roberto Firmino. Moving through the gears. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. An abundance of space. Given away by the Rossoneri. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Roberto Firmino, the Brazilian, at the ready. It's gone in! And you have to feel for it now. It will go down as an own goal. Well, that own goal has no more time left. First half is up. Underway then in the second half of this Champions League group stage confrontation. Suso has it. And can he make this move count? It's with Mendy. He has plenty of support. Thomas Müller might fancy this one. And they deal with the threat this time. It's with Fabinho. Naby Keita. It's with Roberto Firmino. Oxlade Chamberlain. Oxlade Chamberlain. And Firmino. It's there for him. The goalkeeper relatively untroubled. Yeah, he's not, he's not going to let that one in, Derek. It looked as though he was in, 
But credit to the defender, Lee. Yeah, he hustled him, made his... Our main feature today on EA TV, two great clubs. It's coming up for you live. Hi there everybody and a big warm welcome to you all to the San Siro Stadium and Alan Smith has made the journey to join me, Martin Tyler. Well this is this amazing derby in this city of Milan where both teams are at home, whichever way round the fixture list tells us. Yeah, and that's a bit of a, a strange situation for English fans at least who can't get their heads round sharing ground. I try one now! He really gave it the laces there, didn't he, Alan? Yeah, he did connect with it beautifully. Not a bad effort at all. Mendy. Telemans. Stopping the pass, getting through with good piece of anticipation. Shots on here. It was a chance maybe to hit the target. He certainly went for strength. Nothing wrong with the connection either. Joel Matty. Well, the visiting manager will know all the scenarios here. If they uh, win, obviously, that's what he's trying to do. And they could actually go top if other results go their way today. Yes, an awful long way to go, of course. But it would send a message, I think, to their rivals. In... He's got his shot off now. Oh, it's the post. The keeper might be needed again. He didn't hang on to the ball. So close to taking the lead there, but the woodwork denying them. Got to keep playing the way they are. Playing some good stuff at the moment. Gets his cross in. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Could have played him in, but in the end, the goalkeeper relieved that he didn't. Well, they're glad to have him in the lineup today, aren't they? They wouldn't want to miss out on his talents, Milan. What a creative player. The most assists in the league with three so far. Franco Vasquez. Tackle goes in. Great interception. This could be it. No offside here for the goalkeeper. He's done very well in that one-on-one. -on -one. Well, it was a battle of wits almost, wasn't it? And the keeper didn't commit himself, stayed on his feet, asked the question of the attacker. Taking on the defenders. He's got there, but got the ball away as well. Just cleared downfield, not a proper pass because the pressure is so intense. That's a good tackle, and that clearly is a goal kick. 
the home side will be in action again. And you will be able to see it on EA Sports in Serie A. Well read by the defender. Thomas Müller. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Telemans. Shots off! First goal is always a crucial goal, and they've just got it. Well, the keeper, he is just flat-footed, and he can only admire that, the way he's hit it first time. Milan have that lead. Franco Vasquez. Perisic. Now Vallejo. Thomas Müller. In behind the defenders. Suso. That's a great clearance. Telemans. He's read that, hasn't he? And made the interception, made it look easy, actually. And that's half time. Signal. Players out and raring to go for the second half with Milan in front at the moment. Mendy. Well, now they've got the ball, what are they going to do with it? Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. Perisic! Oh, that's a good header.